Hello friends, in this video I'd like to solve the following problem from the Indian Mathematical Olympiad 1991 problem number 7. We want to find all the real solutions to the following system of equations. x plus y minus z equals 4, x squared minus y squared plus z squared equals minus 4, x, y, z equals 6. So, it's a rather easy problem, here are my hints. First, Let's enumerate our equations, 1, 2, 3. Using equation number 1, you can express y in terms of x and z. Then you can express x times z in terms of y using equations 1 and 2. And finally, after setting x times z as a sum function of y, you can solve the very last equation to get y. And then you can compute remaining two variables. So give this problem a try and I will see you in just a minute. Okay, so let's, as I said, from equation number one, from equation number one, we see that y, or that, yes, y equals uh, minus x plus z plus 4, and moreover, we can also notice that that means that z equals x plus y minus 4. And now, I will, I will take this equation, I, I will set it into my second equation. So, from 2 and this equation, which I mark asterisk, we have the following x squared minus y squared, so minus x plus z plus 4 squared plus z squared equals minus 4, and then simplify it. It's x squared minus x squared minus z squared minus 16 uh, plus 2xz uh, plus 2xz, is it right? Probably is. Uh, plus xz uh, plus 8x minus 8z plus z squared equals minus 4. And now, simplifications, x squared, x squared, z squared, z squared, they are gone. We can divide by 2, and now we know that xz plus 4x minus 4z equals uh, 12 over 2, 6. And now I will use this equation which I derived. I will mark it as uh, triangle. So from condition triangle, so from my condition triangle, instead of uh, instead of uh, z, I can put x plus y minus four. So I have xz plus 4x minus 4, x plus y minus 4 equals 6. And that allows me to compute xz, because xz, I have plus 4x minus 4x, so x is gone, minus 4 times y plus 16 equals 6. So in other words, x times z equals 4y minus 10. 4y minus 10. Let's remember that equation. Maybe I will write it all in green. And I will mark it condition uh, square. Very well. What can we do now? We have expressed xz in terms of y. So we can use the last equation, because here we have x times z. So from equation number 3, so from equation number 3, we have the following, x, y, z, so y, 4y minus 10 equals 6. So it's from... Uh, condition number 3 and equation number square. <laughs>
number square. Okay. okay, so we have a quadratic equation. So 4y squared minus 10 times y minus 6 equals 0. We can actually divide by 2. 2y squared minus 5y minus 3 equals 0. And we can compute our quadratic discriminant. So delta equals 25 plus 4 times 2 times 3. 4 times 2 is 8, 8 times 3 is 24. So actually the whole discriminant is 49. Square root of delta is 7. So we have two solutions. Either, either y equals 5 minus 7 over 4, which is minus 1 half, or y equals 5 plus 7 over 4, which is 3. And now let's check both cases separately. So case number 1, case number 1, y equals minus 1 half. Now we wish to find x and z, and we will use condition which I marked square, and we will use condition which I marked for example, uh, triangle. So from triangle, from condition triangle, we can find z. Z equals what exactly? x plus y minus 4. x plus y, but y is minus 1 half, x plus y minus 4. So it's x minus 9 over 2. And from condition which I marked square, square, uh, xz equals 4y minus 10. So xz, but z is z, uh, x minus 9 over 2 equals 4y minus 10. 4y minus 10. Another quadratic equation, x squared minus 9 over 2x. And we can put it on the left-hand side. Here we have minus 2 minus 10. Minus 2 minus 10 is minus 12, so we have plus 12. We can multiply by 2, actually. 2x squared minus 9 times x plus 24 is 0. And let's compute quadratic discriminant. It's 81 minus 4 times 2 times 24. Clearly, it's less than 0, so no real solutions here. No real solutions. No solutions there, because we are only dealing with real numbers. So case number 1 was unfruitful. <laughs> case number 2. Maybe case number two will give us some solutions. Y equals three. Again, from condition triangle. From condition triangle, Z equals X plus Y, but Y is three minus four. So it's X minus one. And now from equation From equation square, which I marked square, x times z, but z is x minus 1, equals 4 times uh, y minus 10. So it's x squared minus x. Here we have 12 minus 10 is plus 2, so it's minus 2. And now we can easily guess roots x plus 1 x minus 2 equals 0. So we have two possibilities. If x is minus 1, then z is x minus 1. So z equals minus 2. Or x equals 2, and then z equals 1. So we have, in fact, only two triples of solutions. 
So let's write it the only real triples of solutions either x is minus 1 y is 3 and z is minus 2 that's one possibility or x is 2 y is 3 z is 1 and that is our solution set for okay so yes very nice so thank you very much for watching i will see you next time goodbye